This is Jason, the juxtaposed active sentry on network. It's basically a mobile IP camera built from an old Roomba and a Raspberry Pi. So the Pi is running an Apache web server so it can host its own web-based controller interface. It has PHP to execute the web commands as local shell scripts which control the camera and call custom-built Python programs which interface the GPIO pins directly. The GPIO control board has BJT transistors for the simple on-off switching and two dual bridge H-bridges uh, for driving the four motors. There's two for the wheels and two in the pan and silt. Uh, the camera is a high resolution Logitech webcam connected directly to the Pi via USB. Uh, the whole thing is powered by a 12 volt sealed lead acid battery with 7 amp hours of capacity so I could theoretically drive this thing continuously non-stop for about 3.5 hours. Uh, it also has a solar charge controller so the battery can be charged without interrupting power to the rest of the bot for indefinite operation. It just drives into this docking station with these uh, spring-loaded contacts. You can see the light goes out when it's not charging. The light comes on when it is charging. Um, voltage regulation. DC to DC buck step-down converters. They power all my 5-volt components like the camera and the Pi. Um, they are super efficient, like they don't get warm at all no matter how long you leave them running and you can get them super cheap on eBay. So here's the self-hosted web interface. The Pi automatically connects to an SSID of my choosing upon boot up, so just knowing its IP, I can connect to it with a standard web browser. The video works really well. The Pi has the Linux program MJPEG Streamer installed, which has no problem handling 640x480 at 25 frames per second. These buttons here are generated by a Pi plugin called WebIOPi. And I have them mapped to keyboard controls using JavaScript events. And since I granted Apache some root access, these auxiliary controls here on the right can execute shell scripts so I can run any Linux command, like starting or stopping services, rebooting, or even some GPO macros and programs. Alright, so here she is in action. Not to mention, it makes a great kitty toy. <laughs> <laughs> 